we leave our legacy in your hands. Hej, cześć, się wam wszystkim ludzie z tej strony, Jack, witam się z wami bardzo serdecznie w kolejnym materiale zagrajmy w Hogwarts Legacy, na start którego... Właśnie się skrzat teleportował, kiedy wie gdzie. E, na start którego <śmiech> oddamy 13 kolejnych księżyców Gladwinowi Moonowi i odblokujemy sobie trzeci poziom Alohomory, który niestety jest wymagany, aby wymaksować tę grę, więc... I hope you've been staying vigilant with those demigod statues. Someone must. Więc pozbierałem sobie troszeczkę spora, że zebrałem prawie wszystkie, które były na terenach poza Hogwartem. Jeszcze muszę zebrać chyba jeden albo dwa, które są poza Hogwartem i wszystkie, które są w Hogwarcie. Hello, Mr. Moon. Oh, greetings. Any luck removing some more of those demigod statues? A żebyś wiedział. I actually have some moons for you. Dear me, you have been busy. Incredible, thank you. You're ready for the final Alahamora lesson. With this knowledge, no lock shall ever stand in your way. You have done all I asked. I only wish I knew who put those statues everywhere in the first place. <sighs> Alas. If you do find more, please feel free to remove them. You'll be doing your caretaker a huge service. And if I ever find out who the bully is behind this cruel trick, I shall let you know. Thank you once again for your assistance and tenacity. Now that you've mastered Alahamora, no lock is unbreakable. Uh, but do feel free to keep finding Demigai's statues and removing those moons. No, niestety problem jest to, że trzeba mieć te trzeci lewe, żeby w sumie wszystkie zdobyć, więc było to nieuniknione. Aby zdobyć trzeci level, no, dlatego kto by szukał. A ja akurat chciałem, bo jak mówiłem, chcę tą grę wymaksować, choć nie na odcinku, bo maksowanie takich gier z otwartym światem to głównie jest po prostu latanie od punktu A do punktu B z znacznikami, szukanie sobie paru rzeczy. A na odcinku wiem, że Sarge takie coś robił, ale... Jakby w sensie, ja nie uważam, że wszystko należy pokazywać. Wiem, że tak robił Ace Valhalla. I tam na przykład latanie po jakieś skarby i tak dalej, to są takie ważne skarby, to były te tajemnice, jakie tam były. To chyba tak to się nazywało, tajemnice. To to jest okej, okay. ale znajdowanie każdego takiego żu takiej żółtej skrzynki, która jest jako skarb, no to to już takie średnie trochę do pokazywania. Ale to jest tylko i wyłącznie moje zdanie. Co tam Sarge robił, no to to już wiadomo, to jest jego sposób na grę. Dobra, popi czy Nati? Najpierw popi, myślę. Więc dobrze. Ona powinna być tutaj, tak więc cyk. E, nie, nie to. Fast travel pogadane, bo akurat z nią to powinna być tylko rozmowa, a u Nati to powinien być cały quest. Chciałem tu zrobić jeszcze fabułę, no ale zobaczymy, jak pójdą te questy. Dobra, Poppy powinna być tam. To się mietłą tam dostanę ździebko szybciej. A właśnie, zrobiłem sobie, mam taką mietłę za wyzwanie z platformami do lądowania. E, chyba. Ewentualnie za wyzwanie... Oh, good. The Demigai's statues and the moons contained therein were placed as they were for good reason. You should not meddle in the personal affairs of others. I don't think Mr. Pemberton meant to use his own stationery. He knows something about those Demigai's moons. He's in Hogsmeade, apparently. Perhaps I shall pay him a visit. O proszę, czyli niby moon, ale w sumie chyba sam autor tego dowcipu się odezwał. Do nas. Dobra, ale najpierw popi. There you are. You were in such a state when you left. The poachers got to my gran. Someone recognized me in Hauntel Hall and they got to her. What do you mean? Is she alright? She's fine, thank goodness. But they were at her house, our house. They assumed I'd sent the egg there. She said they took the whole place apart looking for it, screaming that we'd cost them everything. 
If your grand's all right and they didn't get the egg, then perhaps we're fine. I should have known. I underestimated the poachers. And now another creature's in danger. What do you mean? The poachers refused to leave empty-handed, so they took valuable journals that Gran had discovered when she was researching rare creatures. One of them contained theories about a secret hiding place of the Snidget, oh. long thought to be extinct. No, ja wiem, ale niech tam dopyta nasz bohater. Exactly what kind of creature is a Snidget? It's a small bird with golden feathers. It's incredible. It has rotational wings that allow it to dart quickly in any direction. In fact, the golden snitch in Quidditch is based on the Snidget, which barbarically was actually used in the sport hundreds of years ago. Why would Snidgets be valuable to poachers? They could make more money with Snidgets than they ever would have fighting dragons. The golden Snidget's feathers and eyes are incredibly valuable. That's why they're believed to be extinct. They were hunted out of existence by wizard kind. If the poachers found some now, I can't bear to think about the horrific way they'd be bred and killed for profit. Pewnie, po co? Ale czarodzieje też tutaj byli naprawdę zmyślni. Po co wyhodować sobie jakieś tam, nie wiem, gniazdo, takie duże tych znikaczy? Hodować je, hodować i kiedy jakiś sam sobie umrze, no to wtedy go wiadomo, wybebeszyć, zabrać co cenne i potem go pochować. Nie, polujmy na nie, zabijmy wszystkie, które są tylko w zasięgu, a potem, ojejku, wszystkie znikacze wyginęły. Jak to się stało? No, ciekawe jak, debile. Where exactly are these snidgets allegedly hidden? Gran says the journals were a bit cryptic, which is good. Perhaps the poachers won't be clever enough to find the birds. From what she recalls, the journals only noted that the key to finding them lay in the moonlight. Gran thinks it can be narrowed down to a handful of locations. I take it you aren't going to let the poachers anywhere near the Snidgets. Gran wants me to stay out of it. But I know she's devastated that poachers might go after the Snidgets, if they still exist. We had the element of surprise on our side when we saved that dragon. But the poachers will be watching for us now. We need allies. Others who hate the poachers enough to help us, who value creatures as much Merlin's as... Merlin's beard! You're a genius! The centaurs! They'd want the Snidgets protected at all costs. No, prawie na pewno będą wrogo nastawione. Ale dobra, bądźmy optymistami, pogadajmy. Sounds as if we need to go and talk to the centaurs. We'll need to be careful in how we approach them. Tensions with them are high. Still, I think they may be our only hope. Let me think on it. I'll let you know as soon as I have a plan. No, tak jak sądziłem, to jest tylko gadka. E, więc co, Nati była obok... Czy była w Hogsmeade, z tego co kojarzę? No, ale jeszcze jest to. On jest gdzie? Tutaj. A Nati... Nie widzę jej póki co, no ale to dojdziemy tam ewentualnie. Dobra. Południowe Hogsmeade. Let's go! Jak podróżuję do Hogsmeade, to jest chyba naj... najczęściej używany przeze mnie punkt fast travelu. Pardon me, sir, but about those curious demigod statues I've seen. What? Who are you? Why do you ask? They're quite clever. Oh, thank you. A lot of craftsmanship and care went into them. Down, I assume. So you did create them? I... Uh, yes, I did. It was a ploy to give that pathetic oaf Moon a taste of the grief he caused me years ago. You are the one who's been pilfering them. I am, at the request of Mr. Moon. I received your owl on your stationery. <clears throat> ah, well, fitting Moon would enlist a student, too cowardly to do it himself, <laughs> hasn't changed a bit. Even when we were at school, he was a cowardly bully. Gave me a horrible nickname, which I shan't repeat. I was thrilled when we left school and he seemed gone for good. 
Then I started seeing him around Hogsmeade. It was too much. Even if I do take satisfaction in that his life's destiny was to be a lowly caretaker. Mr. Moon does a good deal for the school, and he's taught me a lot. He's terrified of those statues. <laughs> I know. You should have seen his face when that boggart appeared. Oh, priceless. That's when I knew what I needed to do. I simply didn't want to encounter him anymore. So, I shrewdly put a boggart in his path to learn his greatest fear. I then created the demiguy statues to keep him in his place, so to speak. The moons were inspired play on his name. It worked brilliantly until you started clearing them out. Fuck no. Actually, it's only to be var. Some should be varti. Actually, the statues are a form of bullying. You're no better than him. Perhaps it's time you both moved on. Ah, <sighs> fair point, I suppose. If they've terrified him, as you say, he may have learned his lesson. Okay, teraz mam pogadać z Moonem. Dobra, no to w takim razie do Hogwartu, żeby to zakończyć. Tu, tu, tu. Panie Moon, wiem kto pana tak załatwił. Mr. Moon, I've learned who's behind the demiguy statues. It was a classmate of yours that you bullied, Piers Pemberton. Oh, am I unknown? Pigtails Piers. I don't think he likes being called that. Of course he does! Oh, we had such flowing locks! Oh, we used to laugh about them! <laughs> I laugh the hardest of all! Clever, clever man. Hmm. I'd no idea he was so devious! <laughs> I must go and congratulate him. Whatever statues remain seem less terrifying now that I know they were put out by old pigtails. Continue collecting them if you like. As for me, I'm gonna go and pay a visit to my old friend. Aby ta wizyta nie skończyła się pojedynkiem. Bo nie jestem nawet pewien, kto by go wygrał. Thank you for your persistence and cleverness. I confronted Piers about it, and he confessed straight away. The old rascal. We've agreed to let bygones be bygones. Uh, don't forget to say hello the next time you're in the Three Broomsticks. Thrilled to be back there again. Okay. Czyli podali sobie ręce, zapomnieli o wszystkim, no i można powiedzieć, że mamy takie dobre zakończenie tej historii. Choć nie wiem, czy dałoby się to powrazić tak, żeby oni, żeby oni właśnie zaczęli się napieprzać między sobą. Ale okej. Okay. Dobra, Nati jest w tym miejscu. No to co? Znowu tutaj, do południowego, Hogsmeade. Kurde, fajnie by było nauczyć się, znaczy też stać się animagiem, ale coś mi się tak śmiesznie wydaje, że raczej tego twórcy chyba nie przewidzieli. Znaczy przewidzieli, że tylko wspomnieli o tym, że... I think I know how and where to approach the centaurs about protecting the Snidgets. Meet me in the Forbidden Forest. Okej. Okay. Że wspomnieli o tym, że Nat jest animagiem, no ale niestety nam się raczej nie uda zostać animagiem. A szkoda. I'm ready to do what's needed to take Harlow down. I know you have a plan. We must gather information from the friends of Mr. Bickle that Archie and Mrs. Bickle mentioned. Agabus Filbert... Otto Dibel and Mr. and Mrs. Webb. All right. I suggest that you speak with each of them while I head to the Hogshead. I saw some Ashwinders heading there. And as my mother would never go near the Hogshead, she is less likely to learn of my activities than if I were to wander the village questioning its residents. 
Where am I to find these friends of his? I do not know about Mr. Rabe, but his wife, Daisy, is often in Hogsmeade, as is Agabus Filbert. And Otto Dibble, he works at Gladrags, so you will likely find him there. What sort of information am I trying to gather from these people? They may know what evidence Mr. Bickle had against Harlow, or they may have evidence of their own. We simply need to know whatever they know. Very well. I'll speak with them, see what I can learn. I knew I could rely on you. We need to know how they are being blackmailed by Rookwood and Harlow. Meet me here after you have spoken with them. Hopefully by the time you return, I will be able to move a bit more freely. Okay, to mamy trzy cele. Najbliżej jest chyba... W sumie nawet nie jestem pewien kto, bo to są nie są czy są jedna ta sama. Ale Gladrak jest chyba najbliżej, tak mi się wydaje. A ona jest wewnątrz. On albo on. Tam na samej górze aż. Może no dobra. Prawie na samej. Na samej górze to jest ten sekretny pokój. Mrs. Rape should be nearby. A, pani Rape, okej. O, Isko, co have I done? Mrs. Rape, I wondered if I might speak with you about Theophilus Harlow. I'm a friend of the Bickles and I'm trying to gather evidence against him. Poor Joanna and little Archie. And now Harlow has taken my darling Isco. What do you mean? Why? <laughs> I'm a security guard at Gringotts, and my husband is a curse breaker for them. Harlow approached me about helping him extort my colleagues into giving him treasures from the vaults. And you declined? Of course I declined. Repeatedly. I thought they'd given up until I came home one night and found my husband gone and a note affixed to my door with a knife. The note stated that I only had a few days to reconsider helping with some banking needs and that my husband would appreciate it if I acted quickly. But the help Harlow wants is help that I cannot give and my dearest Isco is paying the price. Czego nie zapłaci, uratujemy typa. Ale najpierw popytajmy. Why wouldn't Harlow extort your husband? Isco's job is even more removed from the vaults than mine. He travels the world for the bank. He could do nothing for Harlow. I'm the one in the bank on a daily basis, which evidently makes me an enticing target for blackmail. Have you helped Harlow since your husband was taken? No. I'm worried sick about Isco, but he'd never want me to compromise my integrity. I also know that he's extremely clever. That said, I was hoping he would have escaped by now. It makes me concerned as to why he hasn't. Are you sure the note means that your husband was kidnapped? What else could it possibly mean? Besides, I came home to find that someone had trampled the daisies in our garden. It may sound silly, but those were Isco's pride and joy. He would never have let that happen. Okay. Thank you, Mrs. Rabe. Knowing the lengths that Harlow will go to is helpful, albeit more than disturbing. Mr. Bickle was trying to help us, but now he's gone. I don't know what to do. I shall do all I can to get evidence against Harlow, Mrs. Rabe. Very well. Here's the note I received. You must be careful as well. Please don't put yourself in danger. No, ze mną jest trochę jak z Harrym, czyli... <śmiech> ja nie szukam kłopotów. To one mnie znajdują. Okej. Okay. Pani Rebi, liczymy na to, że ponownie rozważy Pani naszą prośbę o pomoc w sprawach bankowych. Daliśmy Pani dość czasu na podjęcie własnej decyzji, ale nasze pokłady cierpliwości zaczynają się wyczerpywać. Wiemy, że Pani mąż bardzo by to docenił, gdyby dostrzegła Pani wartość współpracy z nami. Czy możemy spodziewać się odpowiedzi do końca tego dnia? Najlepiej, gdyby zwara pozostała między nami. Zapewne Pani rozumie, co mamy na myśli. Some evidence worth hanging on to. Thank you. Now, to find Mr. Bickle's other two friends. Okay, czyli teraz Agabus Filbert i Otton Dibble. 49. O, dobra, tu będzie o wiele bliżej. Otto Dibble works at Gladrax. I should check there. Dobra. Uh, please tell me you didn't take it, but perhaps it's been here all along. Mr. Dibble, may I speak with you? 
It's about Theophilus Harlow. I have nothing to say about him. Uh, may I interest you in a stunning cravat today? Please, sir, I'd like to help. I spoke to Mrs. Bickle. <laughs> you know the Bickles? Mm, all right, but we must be discreet. Can't have Mr. Hill hearing this. I know Mr. Hill. He was kind to me the day of the troll attack. Oh, he's a good man. But even he wouldn't understand about Harlow. It started a few weeks ago. I was distracted, reading a note when you-know-who came into the shop. I had the note behind the counter and offered to help him. He stared at me for a moment, then asked me to check on an order he'd placed. I went into the storeroom to check on what turned out to be a non-existent order. When I returned, he was holding the note. What was in the note? It was a note from Rosie Hill, Mr. Hill's daughter. You see, we've been, well, secretly engaged these past six months. We haven't told Mr. Hill yet. I dare say he has higher hopes for her. Harlow advised me in no uncertain terms that my relationship with Rosie, not to mention my employment here, depended upon my cooperation. What does he ask you to do? It all happened so quickly. In an instant, he took a very expensive scarf from the counter, pocketed it, and smiled. He said, your secret is safe as long as I can supply my lady friend with delightful items like this every so often. I've been able to cover for his requests until now with some creative bookkeeping, but I can't keep it out for much longer. I'm terrified to say anything. I could never live without Rosie. No dobra. Hmm. Tego też musimy przepytać. Could you give me a bit more detail about the note? That might help me to identify it should I come across it. It's on Rosie's special pink stationery. It has her monogram at the top, RH. That's how Mr. Hill would know it was real. Okay. What have you been doing to keep the extortion a secret? Well, as I mentioned, creative bookkeeping. And I've also been trying to cover the costs with my own savings, but I'm running out of money. Of course, none of this bodes well for my efforts to improve my circumstances and to be worthy of Rosie. No, nie wiem, czy to tak źle. W sensie, skoro nie tuszujesz tylko tego, że Harlow potajemnie wynosi e, rzeczy z Gladraga, tylko dosłownie praktycznie ty za to płacisz, no to... Nie wiem, czy to jest takie niebycie godne. Fakt, tuszujesz całą sprawę, ale nie ten. To nie jest tak, że, to, że dany przedmiot totalnie znika, tego faktycznie jest sprzedawany i opłacany. Tylko, że nie z kieszeni faktycznego klienta. I met Mr. Hill the day of the troll attack. He was kind to me. Why don't you just tell him? He's a lovely man. But when it comes to Rosie, I fear he loses all perspective. He'd see this as a grave betrayal. I'd lose my job instantly, and Rosie as well. Thank you for telling me. I'm gathering evidence to take Harlow down. I would love nothing more than to see him rotting in Azkaban, but be careful. He's an awful man and incredibly dangerous. As for Rosie's letter, should you happen upon it, I have committed it to memory. You may destroy it immediately. Understood. Now hurry off before Mr. Hill returns. Well, we're on the right track. Now to find the last of Mr. Bickle's friends. <laughs> Ciekawą stronę to powoli się kieruje. W sensie też... Wow, co to za światło? Ciekawi mnie bardziej, jak to będzie pociągnięte. Hmm. Agabus Filbert must be around here somewhere. Jeśli chodzi o ten świński web. Hello there. Excuse me, Mr. Filbert. I wondered if I might speak with you about your dealings with Theophilus Harlow. I hope to ease Mrs. Bickle's mind by gathering evidence against him. So tragic what happened to Bickle. He wanted me to speak out against Harlow for an act of violence committed against me. But I feared Harlow's retaliation, and so I refused. If you had spoken out against him, as Mr. Bickle asked, perhaps Harlow would be locked away by now. Perhaps. But... Uh, perhaps I would have suffered a similar fate. You said that Harlow committed an act of violence against you. Could you tell me what happened? Before my extraordinary wife, Dulcibella, passed away, 
she had just completed a small book of poetry. As a surprise for her birthday, one she never had the chance to celebrate, I had the book beautifully bound and plated in gold. One day, Harlow came calling to punish me for having spoken out against the Neanderthals that comprise Brookwood's lot. Before I knew it, I'd been petrified, and Harlow was rifling through my home. He found the book of poetry with its exquisite gold plating. I watched helplessly, lying there in my entranceway as he walked away with the book, laughing as he went. I was shaken to my core. Still am, to be honest. I imagine you fear Harlow retaliating again. But do you mind if I share this information with Officer Singer? <sighs> I suppose I have no choice. This extortion can't go on forever. You can pass it on to anyone who may be willing to help. Never up. Harlow does not like people talking, as you already know. I've spoken with Mr. Bickle's friend. Now to find Natty. Okay. So it's all. Czyli mamy zebrane jako takie dowody, bo nie wiem w sumie jak, jak to inaczej określić. No, niby dowody są na szantaż, ale czy to są to dowody twarde? Jeśli oni dalej się boją Harlowa, to mogą to natychmiast odwołać. Znaczy w sumie nie, wróć, tych dwóch ostatnich, bo... Uh... It's not like Natty to be late. She said she was going to the hog's head. Perhaps I'll find her there. Oho, i to już mi się powoli nie podoba. E, dobra, ale wracając, bo na przykład ten list z szantażem od tej pracownicy banku, to już jest twardy dowód. Tego Harlow nie jest w stanie e, za żadne skarby zaprzeczyć, że takie coś zostało wysłane. Ale jednocześnie... Rebellion. Czekaj, czy mogę wyjść na zaplecze? Okej, okay, nic mi takiego nie robi, no to sobie przejdziemy trochę szybciej. Serio nie zebrałem tej strony? Doki przy świeckim łbie. Spoczy. O, o. Jest różdżka Nati. I ślad z kwiatów. Natty's wand. She can cast without it. She wanted me to find this. She's in trouble. Revelio will show me where she was taken. Revelio. Ha, no tak. Po co? Po co ślad z kwiatów, z którą możemy iść dosłownie po śladach po prostu Natty i typów, którzy ją pewnie zabrali. Nosy little students get what's coming to them. Jakieś cwany? To chodź! Ona solo! Jak cię zaraz gościu konfringnę, to będziesz... O, uważcie, to dokładnie w taki sam sposób znikniesz w ścianie. <laughs> Okej, okay. to wyszło trochę niespodziewane. Rebellion. <laughs> Zatem mogłem go krucjatnąć. Kryjówka pod świńskim łbem i barman nic się z tego nie robi. Ciekawe. Ta miałem wcześniej, jak mówił o Junuku. Trzeba pociągnąć. O. Ha, dobra, muszę przytrzymać. Teraz się otworzy? The hidden door. Mhm. Hmm, w sumie kto wie, może gościu nie wie. Natty must have been taken this way. I need to find her quickly. Może gościu nie wie, że to coś tutaj jest. Może trochę nie chcę się w to wierzyć. Rebellion. A jest trochę z tego mamy... I'd better be sure I'm not seen. Jak się mogę skradać? To z wielką chęcią. Ło, co to za jakaś? Hmm. 
Revelio. A, czyli ją zgarnęli, żeby mnie tutaj zwabić. Okej. Okay. Zwabienie się uda, ale już niestety walka ze mną tak średnio. A, okej, okay, dobra, czyli jednak walczymy. Okej. Okay. Crucio! O kurde, jak mi się przesłoni, no. Bang! 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 O! Ho, 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 ho. Pięknie, klątę ma krwizę, klątę ma krwizę działała. Nie mogę, kurde, piękne. Ej, to jest nad... to... Normalnie użyłem właśnie starożytnej magii i zadziałał tak samo, jakbym użył awady. No po prostu piękne. Jesteś mi tak drogi jak wróżebnik, który swym szpie... A, to jest chyba z tych tomików. The book of poems that was taken from Agabus Filbert. He'll be thrilled to have this back. Okay, nie wiem, czy to był cały tomik, no ale... Aha! I see you! Ja czekam też. Weźmy do tego setu zaklęć. Rebellion. To jeszcze trochę fajsiwa. Dziękować. Tutaj co? Do punktu wyjścia? Iglica wieży. Okej. Okay. Zabawa do pokoju życzeń zawsze to będzie. Tutaj są jakieś skrzynie. Ok, jest liścik. Otto Dibble's love letter from Rosie. He wanted me to destroy this if I found it. Możemy zniszczyć, a możemy też po prostu zachować przy sobie, tak, bo jeśli my tego komuś nie pokażemy, no to nikt nie będzie wiedział o istnieniu tego. Tak więc... Szukamy... A? Czekaj, tam jest jakaś lepsza skrzynka. Ale nie, nie to. O! Okej, okay. nie sądziłem, że to podziała, no ale dobra. Akio! Bombada! A i tutaj... A dobra, to jest zwykła skrzynka. To mech. Szybsze przejście. W miarę. Lecimy dalej. Tu jest taka lepsza skrzynia. Tylko pytanie, jak się tam dostać? Czy tutaj... Po prostu wystarczy iść do góry? Perhaps she'll tell us where we can find that friend of hers. Nah, she's determined to say nothing. The boss will deal with her when he arrives. Please, defender. Defender. Jest Palermus. Nie mam? Hm, tak rzadko go używam, że. No. Dawaj to jeszcze raz, tak na razie. Nie patrz, jak różkę trzymasz, baranie. Okej, okay, no to tutaj mamy przejście, stricte. A, i tu jest ta skrzynia. 
Co w środku? Legendarny przedmiot na facjatę. Okej. Okay. No, zobaczymy. Czemu tak jest tłumione? Rebellion. A, okej, okay, tutaj będzie coś ważnego jest schowane, więc na razie odpuścimy. Co? Mr. Rape! Daisy told me you've been abducted. You spoke with my wife. How is she? Worried about you. Are you all right? I am all right. Thank you for coming. These locks are cursed. And there's an anti-apparition jinx on the cells. Even Natty's skill with wandless magic cannot free us. I need you to find my wand. Use mine. We'll find yours together once you're out of there. I need my wand for this. Using one with which I have no connection may not work as well or as quickly. And we cannot risk detection. I shall do my best. Any idea where it might be? It's nearby. I can sense it. Understood. I'll find it. Okay, there's Your friend Natty was not able to summon my wand. It must be blocked by something. Hello, Hamora. It's the Rape's wand. He'll be glad to have this back. Dobra. Trzymaj mordo. Mr. Rape, I found your wand. Well done. I knew it was nearby. Now, you best stand back. One never knows how a curse will react to being broken. Aha, użyłeś tego. Sam mógłbym to zrobić, stary. A nie, okej, okay, dobra, zwracam honor. Tylko kolor jest podobny. Thank you, Mr. Isko. My pleasure. And thank you, my friend. We owe our lives to your bravery. I may be too weak to disapparate with you both, but I can try. You go ahead. Find Officer Singer. We will get out of here on our own. Very well. But be careful. Thank you, my young friend. Be prepared for a fight. These Ashwinders must pay. Okay, jakiś plus minus 5 minut chyba wam wyciąłem, bo poszedłem sobie coś zjeść. Tak więc lecimy. Co, będą wrogowie czy nie? Rebellion. O, oh, come on, już się na walkę nastawiłem. No ale, ale jestem teraz normalnie zawiedziony. Zawiedziony jestem. Ja pierdzielę, no ale bullshit. A, to jest Protego. Pewnie Protego Totalum albo Protego Maxima. Nie, Maxima, Maxima. Czekajcie, jakbym grzmotną zaklęciem w te tarcze, to czy by się od razu wszyscy zalewali? Mam takie śmieszne wrażenie, że te do wody, które zebraliśmy, mogą być chyba troszeczkę za małe. Ale to bardziej wina pewnie tego, jak debilnie jest zrobiony system prawa. Oh, thank goodness the two of you are safe. Isco Rabe told me a couple of students had rescued him. Should have known it was you two. Is Mr. Rabe all right? He is. I sent him home to his wife. Miss Onai, your mother will not be pleased to learn that you're still risking your safety pursuing these dangerous men. Actually, Officer Singer, Natty and I learned of several Hogsmeade residents who've had their lives threatened by the Ashbinders. In addition to abducting Mr. Rabe, to blackmail his wife and Natty, Rookwood and Harlow have also extorted Agabus Filbert and Otto Dibble. Uh, I will look into all of that. As for the two of you, I appreciate what you're trying to do, but you are taking great risk. Next time, please let the authorities handle the Ashwinders. 
No dokładnie, władze nie były zbyt pomocne. With all due respect, officer, the authorities haven't done much about any of this. There's more to taking down an organization like the Ashwinders than simply storming in and hauling them off based on a few accusations. I must insist that you leave them to us. We shall have no further discussion on this. Koleżanko. Natsai, you may wish to speak with your mother about this before I do. My mother will not like this. Thank you again for rescuing me. We shall speak soon. Co się noc zrobiła? Nieźle. Jakby, sorry, ale zlikwidowanie takiej grupy jest naprawdę bardzo proste. Poprzedni odcinek z The Police, czy tam aktualny, i dość mocno to pokazuje. Otóż zgarniecie informatora, idziecie coraz wyżej i wyżej i wyżej i wyżej i wyżej i wyżej i wyżej do głowy gangu, odwalacie głowę gangu i gang idzie w pizdu. Czyli w tym przypadku odwalacie Harlow'a albo Rockwood'a i popiełki przestają istnieć. The Ashwinders have ceased pestering me. I suspect that's your doing. Thank you from me and Rosie both. We're just leaving for our honeymoon. After we tell Mr. Hill of our recent marriage. Wish me luck. Powodzenia, typie. Jeśli sądzisz, że gość jest taki jak sądzisz, no to pewno ci się przyda. Okej, o tutaj. A, to jest to z centaurami. Ale myślę, że tym się jeszcze zajmiemy, bo to może być kolejna misja, która może zniknąć, kiedy będziemy kontynuowali fabułę. I tutaj tylko misje, proszę. Misje, misje, misje. Czyli misja fabularna jeszcze sobie poczeka. Tutaj szukaj skarbu, szukaj skarbu. Okej, okay, czyli na razie mamy tylko misję od e, e, Popi i fabułę. Co mnie nawet zadowala, bo im mniej misji pobocznych, z tych istotnych, e, jest na tej, na mapie, tym lepiej dla mnie. A póki co, ja lecę do, do pokoju życzeń uzupełnić mikstury, pobawić się ze zwierzętami, pozbierać to i owo. No a my widzimy się w kolejnym materiale, zagrajmy w Hogwarts Legacy, do którego już teraz bardzo serdecznie Was zapraszam. Ode mnie to tyle, do usłyszenia. Cześć!